Biodium Super HT PAP pens are used for preparing slides with mounted tissue for microscopy. Specifically, the PAP pen can be used to create hydrophobic barriers around the tissue sections to hold staining solutions in place. If your sections were prepared in OCT freezing medium, the pen should be applied directly to the glass, not on top of the OCT around the section. You may need to carefully scrape away some of the OCT to create a border of clean glass around the section. To get started, press the tip of the PAP pen down on a clean and unused microscope slide to open the tip valve. Do not use your sample slide for this to avoid any liquid spilling on your sections. Keep pressing down until you see the tip fill completely with green fluid. Stop pressing as soon as the tip is completely filled. Next, dry the area around the tissue section with a cotton swab if necessary. Draw an unbroken circle of PAP pen fluid around the section. Do not press the valve down while drawing the barrier. Take care to prevent the PAP pen fluid from touching the tissue section. Let the barrier dry for 15 to 30 seconds before immersing slides or adding buffer. When you are ready to treat your samples, add just enough buffer to fill the barrier without overflowing. A square of parafilm can be placed on top of the section to spread the buffer evenly and prevent evaporation. If you are planning to incubate overnight, store slides in a humidified chamber to prevent evaporation. Biodium offers a regular and mini version of the Super HT PAP pen. The mini version has a 2.5 mm tip and stores enough fluid for 400 applications, while the regular version has a 4 mm tip and is suitable for 800 applications. Visit biodium.com to view our other microscopy related products including mounting medium, fixation buffers, permeabilization buffers, blocking reagents, and cover slip sealants.